Hi, and thanks for joining our CCA video tutorial for today. Today we're going to talk about a new feature called PCM Capture Diagnostics. PCM stands for Pulse Code Modulation. And what it allows you to do is capture an audio sample before DSP processes the audio. And in turn, you can really analyze the voice quality and determine where the issues are coming from. Um, it's intended to deal with voice pulse and voice quality calls over perhaps an FXO port or PRI and it's not uh, really intended to apply for SIP trunks. The other thing that it's really useful for is handling calls with uh, echo or a lot of clicking or popping. And prior to this diagnostic, you really didn't have a tool to isolate where issues were coming from, whether they were a provider or whether they were a UC500 issue or whether they were a phone issue and using PCM Capture Diagnostic, you can really go ahead and capture the audio sample before DSP processes the audio and converts it to voice over IP. And the advantage to this is that if you do find problems with the audio, you can really isolate it as being a provider issue, seeing as how it did not even hit our, um, our equipment. And the other great thing is um, it's also great to tell whether the provider sent a uh, disconnect tone or not, because from the recording, you can go ahead and listen to actually what is being sent in from the provider and validate whether the provider is sending the right tone. So I'm going to go ahead and show you how you can configure this. On the left hand side you want to go ahead and select troubleshoot and telephony diagnostics and then PCM capture. And once PCM capture is launched uh, there's only one thing that you really need to be concerned about and that is typing in the correct voice port. So the first thing you need to do is have a phone line going so that you can actually record from there and then you need to identify which port it's running on and then go ahead and enter the port number. So what you want to do is configure telephony and voice. Go ahead and go to user extensions and select your analog phone. And when you come down here, you'll notice that you can find the port number. So you can go back to your PCM capture and type in the port number. And now when you click begin, what you're going to do is you're going to initiate a call from your analog phone to an IP phone and this will record that phone call. Go ahead and select end and save and save your PCM.dat file. And now what you can do is you can go to this website um, called pcet.cisco.com and open your .dat file. Go ahead and find it. PCM1, open and decode the PCM and what it'll do, it'll convert it into an audio file uh, that you can actually go ahead and listen to. So go ahead and select it and play it. And a few things to keep in mind before beginning your recording are that you really do not want to record more than 10 seconds because it can really be very resource intensive on the box and in turn um, you will also end up with a large PCM.dat file in the flash and this may drain all the flash space. And the only other quick thing to remember is if you're capturing on T1, make sure you specify the B channel because you really don't want to be capturing all the B channels. So um, that's about it. So thanks a lot for joining us today. I we really hope that you can use this new feature to really pinpoint uh, voice quality issues. Thanks a lot.